he is receding. He went off of steroids to prevent any further hair loss. His hairline is getting a lot worse. It's getting thin at the front. Causing him to lose hair. Receding. 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 Welcome to Kenny KO, where you are guaranteed to be triggered. Of course, the video today is on Connor Murphy, but leading up to Connor Murphy's response to the hair loss, that was one of my most requested subjects, was people wanting my opinion if Connor Murphy was losing his hair due to taking anabolics, if he was losing his hair due to genetics, if he was losing his hair for some other random reason out there. I'm like balding though, I don't think she'll like me. But most of you who have been subscribed to the channel for a long time already know my standpoint on Connor Murphy, what I think about his physique. And let's just put this out there right off the bat so I don't get questions about it. I still, to this day, believe that Connor Murphy is natural. But Connor, if you are watching this video, there is one good critique or criticism I definitely want to make known. Whenever I'm doing research for a video on you, I have to watch your vlogs. And trust me, there's nothing wrong with your vlogs. They're entertaining. But can you please, for my sake and probably numerous people out there as well, can you please use a different NCS song than the same song you've been using on your channel for the last couple years? All right guys, so it is the next day. It is Every time there's some type of B-roll or some type of cinematic scene taking place, it's super simple, just head over to NCS, no copyright sounds, pick one of their newest songs that you enjoy, download that MP3, and then put that as the music overlay. Bada bing, bada boom, bada bam. The Connor Murphy hair loss situation was touched on by numerous channels across YouTube's platform. It was More Plates, More Dates, I believe was the first individual to talk about Connor Murphy's hairline. Vegan Gains made a video. I understand where Derek from More Plates, More Dates got the accusations he would have came up with about Connor Murphy and his hairline because he is correct in the sense that Anytime someone takes anabolics, you are gonna show some type of side effects. It's gonna differ individual to individual. The side effects are never a definitive answer of whether someone is natural or not, but it does help give you a little bit of a clue or a hunch as to whether they're lying or not to the camera. Let's make this known yet again though, I still believe Connor Murphy is natural. But so many people have been saying that I've been losing my hair. Is it true? Yes, 100%. I've been losing my hair since I was like 21 years old. Why have I been losing my hair? So for you guys that don't know, hair loss is caused by this molecule called DHT, a derivative of testosterone. As you heard Connor touch on, he talks about DHT, which I'm not gonna go in depth on in this video, but he also goes on right after to talk about his genetics, which is the main reason I didn't even make a video pertaining to this whole subject in the first place because I knew essentially what this was all gonna circle back to. I have close friends and family members who have been balding or have, you know, awful, awful hairlines that started back when they are around 18 or 20. And everyone's gonna have their flaws here and there. No one's gonna be perfect. It's how fast you lose it is your sensitivity to DHT and that is by genetics. Yes, things like steroids increase the amount of DHT in your system. So if you're sensitive to it, it will speed up the process, which is why a lot of people accuse me of being on steroids because I'm losing my hair. But it's not that at all. Look at my dad. This is a picture of my dad, all right? He is completely bald. He started balding when he was 20 years old. That's pretty much it, man. I just said I'm absolutely Connor Murphy goes on to show a picture of his dad, who he said has been balding since around the age of 20, got his receding hairline around then. And it's just such a common thing. Obviously, a lot of people immediately jump on the bandwagon of Connor Murphy taking anabolics because of his receding hairline. He also talks about, at the end of the video, everything he's done to treat his hair thus far to help slow down or prevent his hair from receding as quick as it has been. The drastic amounts of things that I've been doing to keep my hair. I've had a hair transplant, man. April 2017, I had a hair transplant. It definitely helped. I use Rogaine in my hair. I use hair loss shampoo. I get stem cells actually injected into my scalp like every year. I've done so many things to keep my hair. Yeah, man, that's pretty much it. My genetics are absolute shit. That's that's why I've been losing my hair and I've had a hair transplant so I'll give you guys just an honest shot of my hairline right now. Also as I was doing a little research for this video, Connor this girl in your video is probably one of the most thirsty girls I've seen. Please don't demonetize me YouTube. If you demonetize it you're dead. Yeah, oh. My last things hurt Get for a reason. We probably all know that Connor definitely laid some pipe that night. And no, I'm not talking about the plumbing system on the ship. Yeah, oh. My last things hurt Get for a reason. Me. If Connor Murphy goes bald in, say, the next couple years, 
He's still probably on average gonna be pulling more girls than majority of the keyboard warriors in this comment section typing, Connor Murphy's losing his hair. So I mean, at the end of the day, who's the real winner? As I stated at the beginning of the video, guys, the whole reason I'm even making this video, I didn't even wanna make a video touching on this because essentially that was what my gut instinct had already told me is that Connor Murphy just has bad hair genetics deriving from his father and his ancestors, his grandpa. And it's not uncommon. As I mentioned, I've seen it numerous times in my family and my friends. It's not a side effect that you can immediately and definitively say, yes, this guy has a receding hairline. He is 100% taking anabolics. Just to give a little scenario, if Connor Murphy had the receding hairline along with also developing gyno and getting bad acne out of nowhere, then you bet for damn sure I would have published a video instantly. That would be an entire different situation where I could almost definitively say that, yeah, at that point, Connor Murphy is using anabolics. Hopefully that clears the air about Connor Murphy. We all know he's still laying pipe. He's still doing the classic shirts off every single place he goes. You know what? In fact, Connor Murphy would be the perfect mascot for my channel. Shirts off, pants down. If YouTube ever falls through, Connor, I will have a job for you. I hope you guys enjoyed the video. If you did, please make sure to slap a like on it. If you are new to the Kenny KO channel, I hope you subscribe. And on that note, I will catch you guys all in the next one. Peace.